Michigan's first aquatic invasive species landing blitz. This is a time where we're rallying all of our volunteers to go out and talk to boaters about how they can prevent aquatic invasive species. The landing blitz, this is our pilot year, our first try at the landing blitz. It's a chance to come out and talk to boaters as they're moving their boats in and out of the water and a chance to show them a boat wash and the principles of how you prevent moving invasives from one lake to another. Boaters can play a key role in preventing the spread of aquatic invasive species. It only takes a few minutes and what we're looking for is boaters to clean, drain, and dry all boats and equipment. Three simple steps. Take a look as you're pulling your boat out of the water and tying down the whole way from your winch post down to the, the motor. Pick off any plants or mud or anything else that's the cleaning step. Draining, we want to drain your bilge water, your live wells, pull the plug out of your boat, drain out all of that water, and that can prevent the spread of fish diseases and other organisms that you might not be able to see. The last step is to dry your boat. We're looking for folks to either use a towel to wipe down the inside of your live well, the hull of your boat, to remove any organisms that you can't see. It shouldn't take you more than five to 10 minutes to do this action. And we're not looking for somebody to sit there and identify this. Is this milfoil? Is this coontail? They don't have to know what it is. Just take all the weeds off. Drain your bilge pumps. Just do these simple actions and you'll help us prevent invasives going from lake to lake. Prevention is a key step in reducing the impacts of aquatic invasive species. We know that once aquatic invasive species are in our waters, it's extremely costly to manage and control. If we can prevent the introduction and establishment of aquatic invasive species in the first place, it'll save us time and money. The zebra mussels, the quagga mussels, the Eurasian milfoil, these weeds that come in, the starry stonewort, we have about 30 that are causing us a lot of problems right now. It's important to prevent them from coming in because the cost is tremendous once they're in. Once they're in to manage these things, for example, cost us about $25 million a year just for Eurasian milfoil in Michigan. Well, this summer we're hauling this mobile boat washing around from lake to lake and we're spreading the word about invasive species and how we can help to stop the spread from all the lakes. I'm one of those people that doesn't take care of uh, their boat and trailer as much as they should. Seaweeds or whatever uh, when you pull out. Um, and I learned that it only takes five, ten minutes to wash your boat off. Maybe an extra five minutes, maybe, max, ten, if you're real thorough, ten. Um, really easy.